everyone and welcome today to Sipping with Sam. This week I'm looking at Wicksworth Gin. It's an interesting one. Their botanicals are quite unusual and very earthy. The main one that they mention is Renosterbos. That is quite a piney, very, like I say, a very earthy flavor. And they also have cassia bark, which is similar to cinnamon. So because those are very hearty flavors, I wanted to try play with them, but in a more fruity um, and lighter and sweeter way. So we're gonna start off with one shot of Wexworth. A double, of course. Oops. On the nose. I can definitely get that pine. It's very similar to juniper, which is very, very strong. And then I am going to be adding kiwi. So kiwi has that little bit of flavor. And I want the sweetness to come up from there and try and work with that cinnamon, that spiciness. And then the last one that we're doing, this is quite a straightforward one, not as complicated as the normal ones I do, but I'm doing fever tree elderflower tonic water. It's very fruity. Honestly, it smells like berries. So again, it's playing on the fruitiness rather than the spiciness of the gin. And we're just gonna pour that in. There's not too much steeping that needs to go on this time. So let's give it a taste. Oh my word, that's so good. This is so good, this is so yummy. This is really delicious. The fruitiness is definitely there. It works with those more, honestly, when it's something like a fein boss, they can be more difficult, almost medicinal. So playing with that in a fruity way definitely works. It takes away any possibility of it tasting medicinal, strong, it's soft, it's fruity, it's delicious. I'm gonna have another one of these because I'm not over the fact that the long weekend is over. I'll see you next week. Thank you for joining me.